So for the th number two, we're going to do your ship's course is at 150 degrees true at 17 knots. The apparent wind is 40 degrees off the starboard bow at 15 knots. So let's start with what we know. We have the course is 150 at 17 knots. So we're going to measure out 17. And first we're going to... Oops. Okay. About there. And then we're going to have a course of 150. Okay. And so that's going to be right there. Just measure out how long this is going to be. This is going to go up until here. It's important to notice the wording between the two. There's actually a bit of a difference. In the last problem, it said that the apparent wind is from 0, 045 degrees true. This time it's saying it's 40 degrees off the starboard bow. So some people made this mistake where they go off of here, but we don't want to go off of here. We want to go 40 from the bow. So that's going to be 1, 2, 3, 40. So that's where our apparent wind is going to come from. And that's going to be at 15 degrees. So we'll measure out our 15 degrees. Okay, it's going to be right there. Parent, we'll label it. And what we're going to do is we're going to shift our parent to the tip of our heading. Oh, okay, so we'll get this lined up there, this lined up there. We're going to transfer this. Just want to make sure this should still be 15. Yeah, it's about 15, so that's going to be there. So that's our apparent, and then we're going to do our true win now. That's going to go from the tip of our apparent back to where we started. So. And then it's also important to note the true wind's going that way. Um, so we don't want to accidentally read it from, say, like 89 or whatever it might be. Maybe it's 90, but we don't want to read it going this way. We want to read it going this way. That's where we have 269. Boom. So we're going to be 269 degrees true. And our speed is going to be our distance. So we'll go right here down to where these two meet. And that is going to be about 11 knots. So we're going to have 11 knots of true wind. OK, there we go. That's problem two. Not, as ba not too bad. Yeah, if you have any questions so far, feel free to put them in the comment section down below. But don't forget, you can also ask your instructor to help clarify anything um, if there's anything that's confusing about this. So now we're going to move on to our third and final problem. This is going to be with the wind coming straight off of our stern.